Hello everyone, this is a free to deck with another deck review. These are the NPC Impressions Them Foil decks. Um, they've previously done Impressions decks like this with a foil in red, blue, and green. They decided to do pink and mint in a recent Kickstarter project with, I guess, it's more feminine colors. Um, they do have plans for another project, I, but we don't know what that is yet. But anyways, basically the same as the other ones, so I'll try to keep it quick. It says NPC make point cards at com on top. A embossed spade dip that says touch and feel. And impressions foil playing cards on the bottom. Again with some embossing. And lots of shiny foil as well. It's got NPC information on the one side. Make point cards dot com. Uh, specialist in custom made cards. I just noticed it has a little bit of damage on there. <laughs> Whatever, that's on the other side. Top says making. I think it's making cards since 1982. Not quite as long as the SPC, just a, a little bit less time. Bond has a barcode that says NPC made in China. Makepointcards.com. Uh, whatever, it's some information. One of the few decks from companies that are made in China that are actually good. <laughs> the back you see the face and the backs of the cards and you can see they put the foil on the backs which is nice. And it says pink foil tree back, linen plain cards and the other one obviously says mint foil. But the seal is just a standard seal with NPC make plain cards .com on there. So we'll get to the cards. I'm just gonna, oh, I can't scoot it over. On the flap there is a trademark thing. So inside there is a little promo advertising and a promo card. The Joker is the same as the other decks. It's just a, it's just a Joker. Mirror image Joker and a quarter is in black. And this one, that one's blue colored, this one is red colored. The backs. Have that foil, it's impressions as well. Uh, it's, it's an impressions deck as well, so it you can actually feel everything. I can't recall if that the uh, metal looks decks look like that, or they're just foil, but you can see the details, feel the details. The Ace of Spades, fairly standard. It is a spade bib says NPC, make .com. And the other aces are similar designs. We've seen them before in my other reviews, so I'm just going through it briefly. The court cards, again, fairly standard, but it's not USB-C court cards. They came up with their own, which is very nice. And then the number cards are fairly standard as well. Has the pink one. I'll show you. What the green one looks like as well. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's get around to the other side here. So there's your pink. Very nice. And here is the mint. Kind of the greeny color. Very cool. The deck, because of the embossing, the foil is a, a bit thicker than a standard poker deck, that's for sure. But it handles pretty good. I put it next to another deck. You can see it's a fair amount thicker. And that's the cards and the box. So you can imagine how much of a difference is. But it handles pretty good. Um, so that's that. It has a linen fittest embossed. Same with the person. And obviously it's a bit thicker. Stockwise. Uh, hang on a sec here. My apologies. So yes. Put it all the way. The handle pretty good. The cards themselves. Nice and springy. Even though it's a bit thicker, it handles good. One little thing that I did notice. I don't know if it was this deck that was worse or the other one. You can kind of see, especially on the aces.
it's from Fisher, you can tell. Um, you can see, I don't know if you can see, I can see. I'll try to show you. This little quality thing here, you can see all these little specks coming off. It's, I don't know what the issue is, but that's a, definitely a quality issue. Um, that should not happen. But overall, it's a pretty good deck. The back design is a standard back, just like you've seen in the other decks, the trees. Um, I'm not even going to worry about giving this a rating because it's just a fairly standard deck. Looks pretty cool. Whatever I gave, you know, the last impressions for the decks is what will say for this one. Because I rated them already. But, I mean, maybe a little bit less, half a point or whatever, a quarter of a point because of that paint issue on the faces. Yeah. And just see another thing here too, spray them out. There's my little imperfections you see on the backs. None of them are identical. But anyways, that is that. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, let me know what you think. Check out cardpointcards.com and cardpoint.com. Description, uh, discount codes and information in the description below. I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.